how seeds are spread. Fruits and seeds. A fruit is a part of flowering plant that contains seeds. Fruits and seeds can be of different sizes and shapes. Fruits usually have a skin on the outside. Seeds are present inside and flesh around the seed. A fruit has two jobs, to protect the seeds inside and to help spread the seeds. Explode. Explode means to burst or shatter violently and noisily as a result of rapid combustion, excessive internal pressure or other processes. Seed dispersal. Seed dispersal is the movement, spread or transport of seeds away from the parent plant. Seedings. A seedling is a young saprophyte developing out of a plant embryo of a seed. Now let's talk about why seeds must be spread. The plants need to spread the seeds away from themselves. This is called seed dispersal. Seed dispersal happens when fruit is ripe. The seeds are ready to grow into a new plant. Seeds grow into young plant called seedlings. Seedlings need room to grow. They also need light and water. Seedlings cannot grow to be healthy plants if they all have to share water and light in a small area. Plants are adapted to disperse the seeds in different ways. This picture shows how the fruit of some plants disperse the seeds. Some seeds are dispersed by animals. Some fruits use animals to spread their seeds. Fruits that spread in this way must attract the animals to eat them. These fruits are often colorful, soft, juicy, and taste good. They usually have small seeds. Animals such as birds, monkeys, mice, and even elephants eat the fruit. The seeds are passed through the animal's body and are dispersed in the animal's dropping. This may be far away from where the animal ate the food. Some fruits and seeds have spines and hooks. These stick on the fur of the animal or the clothes of the people. The seeds can be carried a long way from the parent plant before they fall off or the animal scratches them off. Some seeds are dispersed by winds. Seeds that are dispersed by winds are lightweight. Dandelions have parachute of hair to help them float in the air. Other seeds have thin papery wings to help them blow away easily. The poppy fruit forms a pepper pot with holes in it. When the wind blows, the seeds are shaken out and blown away. There are some fruits that float. A few seeds are dispersed by water. The fruits must float to carry the seeds away. The fruits have a spongy covering that helps them float. For example, coconut is dispersed by water. Mangroves are the trees that grow in salty water in warm, wet regions. Their seeds, called sea pencils, float upright in the sea until they are washed onto the land. There are some fruits that split open or explode. Some fruits disperse their seeds by themselves. The fruit dries out and splits open to let the seeds fall out. Some fruits explode and shoot out their seeds. For example, bean pods dry out and explode in the hot weather. 
Now let's lastly talk about the fruits that drop and then roll. Some fruits are heavy and round. So when the fruits are ripe, they drop from the tree and roll along the ground. If the fruits have a tough outer shell, they may roll quite far from the parent plant. Large fruits that drop from high branches of the trees roll further. Apple seeds are dispersed this way. Fruits that have softer skin may break open when they hit the ground and scatter the seeds. Animals that eat fallen fruits help to spread the seeds further away from the parent plant.